opening started. And hello everyone, here we are for another Darkwood video. And today, I am recording the video of today, because I thought it would be tomorrow and I could actually do this chill. I obviously have been quite busy, and uh, I still have, thankfully, some uh, videos about the Black Book, so people who want to watch it just feel free, it's gonna come out the same number of days. Um, but I'll be out the weekend, so this is a Friday, I'll be out the weekend, and uh, I don't know about uh, Mondays, but quite some things to do. Anyway, right now, I have about one hour and a half to record and upload at least one. So what I'm gonna do is record this one, upload it, and I'll record like two, maybe three videos so I can be chill next week, I don't know. I won't have to feel the pressure about I need to record. So, anyway. <coughs> what have we been doing? Oh, walking step. Okay. Um, this episode is gonna be quite chill. At least I hope. Because I actually want to... Uh, <coughs> sorry. I actually want to... Move everything in the next house. Show oh, wait. Oh, nothing special. Uh, move everything into the next house. Hopefully we can do it in time. So yeah, now we can almost buy something. Well, if we sell some wood stuff and all that, we can actually get the shovel. So, it is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna disarm this one. Okay, get some wood. Still don't know what's the code about this one. If someone knows, you can feel free and tell me in the comments. Uh, I would need one more piece. But yeah, I cannot just speak to Whatever. Uh, one. Yeah, like this. Yes. Three, four. Should be good. No, four more. Uh, left. No, uh, sorry, right. Need to. Left. Okay, it's fine. I'm looking in this bar that is gonna be showing down. I want four little stacks. Just one more because one stack is a bit of wood. There you go. There you go, beautiful. Now we can gather all this. We can see our friend. Try this. I could actually sell those. I think it's gonna be cheaper. Wait, 30. Uh, it's good. No, no, no. Uh, give me this. Thank you. Yes, I thought about the mushroom, but uh, still quite far. You see, even if I'm kind of halfway, so I need to find a lot. Now about the shovel. Beautiful. Um. Oh, come on, there is a dog outside. Uh, I'm gonna leave this here at least for now. I'm gonna turn that off. We're gonna get. Um. I don't even know what are we gonna get. But from the X mark.
still have some gasoline in this floor. Talking about gasoline, yeah. I don't think it's... Yeah, I think it's enough for one night. Uh, yeah. by the way... Mm, it was about there, just under the labyrinth. Labyrinth. Labyrinth? Labyrinth. No, yeah. L, Cancer, Timo, Field. I think we search this one. Okay. So. <laughs> if you got the reference, tell me in the comments. He's a good guy. What the f did I just heard? I watched some funny videos before coming into this game. Rabbits? What are they running from? The fuck am I? Okay, still need to go this way. Oh, it's gonna bother me, isn't it? Doesn't seem to bother me. I hope. Uh, where am I? Did he make this noise? Goodness. I've never heard dogs make this noise. Where am I? Need to go up? Well, as long as I don't hear that noise again, it was a dog. It looks like... look like a sniff. It's fine. Um, the pasty mouth syndrome when you play something scary. Ah, somewhere here. I think I heard another. Oh, oh, I almost step on those. Where the fuck was the Mark? Hi Mark, hi Brian. Yeah, cock. Never seen one. The game. I know it's somewhere here. Somewhere. It's a fucking mark, you cannot run away, right? I hope not. Now that I got the shovel, the mark ran away. Mark, come back. I want to help with your headache, Mark. Come. Uh, uh control. I wish I had a good memory, but I don't. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's where we got the deer the last time. Oh, and it's raining. Oh, thank fucking god. Nelk. Whatever. <sighs> Tell me it's gonna be stormy at least. It'll be even funnier. Come what the fuck? <laughs> what is it? Must be somewhere. I remember. 
That's why I wanted the fucking shovel for so long. Bear traps. Who put them? Did I disarm them the other day? Weird. Bro, I really swear I don't remember what it is, but it was somewhere here. I know it. Ah, is it this? Little thing here? There? I thought it was a little more clear, but... Uh, nope. I don't even know how to use a shovel, to be honest. <laughs> Is half of the episode gonna be like this? Don't bother me, please. I have a shovel. Was it up? I think it was down. Anyway, with the rain, it's really not helping. It's triggering my fear even more. Maybe it was it. This is quite fucking annoying, not gonna lie. It was supposed to be fast! <laughs> that sounded like an angry dog. I do not wanna disturb you, sir. Should we just come back another day? I had a feeling that you can always see something But it's just a shade Something And I still do honestly believe there is something in a labyrinth that I'm not gonna face. One thing that I'm almost sure is that it was kinda down the labyrinth. Somewhere right in this area. So why am I blind? Mom and dad didn't do the job right. Now I'm fucked. Thank you.
Jesus. This is kind of tilting you. Um. There you go. How do I do this now? Oh, maybe. No? Do I need to go to the internet? Yeah. Give me a second. Um, I hope you won't see a cut. So, where is you? Dark wood. How to defeat the shovel. Hopefully, I won't get spoiled. The shovel, dark wood, general discussions. I hope I won't get spoiled. You can dig dirt, graves, and junk piles. Okay. You can dig up a corner in the area in the background of the tunnel. No, 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 no. Dig up, dig up. I think days don't matter as long as you are not entered the underground. Spend 10 days in the dream. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Fuck oh, on. Shovel Dark Wood Fandom. <sighs> it does much more than with the board nails. Okay. Significantly longer range, be nice. Slower, does less damage than the X. Makes sense. Can be crafted, blah blah blah. Fleet charge did. Can interrupt the charging enemy before. Okay. Um, durability, eating non living targets. 6% of living targets, okay. We'll break down the barricade the doors. And escape. He's holding room, doctors and house, I don't know. Um, shovel blades and care, both old version during the grave stream, I don't care. Shovel subscription, heavy. Mm. It doesn't really help, so it's more as a weapon. Like, they say digging here, they, they talk about digging, when digging, regardless of the durability. Can also be found damaged. Yay, yay. How do you dig in Darkwood? If the player has a shovel on his first visit to the tunnel, to the left can be dug with. Being twice requires a shovel with 100% probability, you will really course with several valuable items. Hmm. I kinda spoil myself. Uh, but... <sighs> How to... Dig... And... X mark dark mm. uh, maybe this one uh, yes of a tutorial area okay reject all get out okay so that's not same game, that's not even the same game. Okay, anyway, doesn't matter. Apparently, there is nothing saying that I can fucking dig this. But, I kinda saw that you could actually get something from this. This tunnel, I guess. 
So you know what? Quickly going home and digging some things, I'll find the corpse. That is gonna jump scare me like an idiot. Probably. I just say dig in the tunnel. Yeah, but that's not really what I freaking want. I saw an X mark. So why am I supposed to dig it? I think that's the obvious thing. You can dig where there is an X mark, right? My door opened both ways. Thank god I removed the trap. So I'm gonna drop this. Um, should be good. Uh, upgrade. I think we can. Great item. Sharp. Mm, inflicts more damage. Lighter, less stamina. Weapon durability. I need the tube. Greatly increase weapon durability. Okay, I need the shovel thing. Okay. I'll sharpen it. Not twice because I cannot. Um, repair. Yeah, why not? Good conditions. Okay. So, I'm probably gonna stay the night here. So, let's turn this on. I think it is already on. Yeah, I think this thing, my protection, is the on thing. But let's go then. So, they mentioned in the left. <clears throat> uh, I've also adjusted a bit my microphone, so maybe it won't trigger nearly as much. Uh, yes. Jump scare! No. Yeah, we've already searched it. <sighs> scary noise already, really. So I can dig here, apparently. Was there another tunnel? Maybe this? Fuck this, actually. You know what? If I remember there was another tunnel somewhere else, we'll go. I really don't remember about another tunnel. I really don't. Another tunnel? Like, where? Maybe the shovel can do something here. I don't know. Well, we start taking care of some materials down there. It will finish in the next episode, I guess. I 
guess we have time for one travel. Maybe two. Just in case. No! No! Ah! I had one already. God damn it, Ryan. Mm. At least a bit of gasoline. So let's start moving. Uh, rocks, whatever, rags. I'll take one. The gun. Nails. The gasoline. It's the gasoline. It's night already. Are you fucking serious? Already? Well, I guess. We actually won't move anything there. This episode was useless. Good to know. Just in case. Oh. Turn it on, maybe. I'll get it. Other way. I am full life, so I don't need this. Oh, my weapon. Almost forgot. And... Pills. I have four pills. It's nice. Um, what else can I take there? Should I take this? I, I will also just go and come back next days. But I, I really feel good, you know. For traveling this much for nothing. Weapon equipped. By rewatching some other episodes, you can really see that we evolved, about the things that we know now, about some little optimization tricks that we're doing, and um, about how much the game evolves in different ways to go on you. And this is, I remember, a 2014 game. Not at all, but also in games we're starting to really develop on to what they are starting to be right now. But well, definitely the game is good. I never heard this noise. Not that I remember. Don't break, please. Thank you. I heard something on the outside, so I'm not gonna move. Do not call attention. But yeah. Anyway. 
Who would have thought finding a job is actually quite fucking hard? Yep. I start my, I would say, second part of school where you start funneling your studies more into the area that you want to be working on. I actually didn't even know what I wanted to do. Until the point that uh, I went to my godfather for like a couple of days. I told him this and uh, he actually told me that uh, yeah, you should try cooking them. You seem to be quite interesting in this kind of thing so maybe take your patience a little further. Why is he throwing me stones? I wish I could go outside and kick your ass. Maybe I could also put bird traps in front of them. But what? If it's just that, I'm fine. It's not even damaging my barricade. So, after I went to see him, we talked a little about it and it was interesting to me. After that, I decided to follow the studies. I don't know if it, that's the correct way of I heard someone in the house. <laughs> it's always funny. Sorry. <laughs> that's a lot less funny. Oh, spirits. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I went to the follow uh, like a cooking course, and um, it was nice. I was actually feeling fine with it. Uh, but the more I would study it, the more I was enjoying it in the theoretical way, like the talking part, the planning part and all this, but not in the practical way. Not that I didn't like it, but I didn't really felt like it, like I couldn't actually follow it correctly, physically. I'm a person that is really thin, so physically, some things that for other people are fine, for me it requires more effort, so in the long duration, it's actually quite annoying for me. And uh, I wouldn't call it impossible, but definitely when you need to work as probably two people at the same time and on top of all, it, uh, your own body kind of prevents you from it, it's really annoying at the point that it's just a stop, uh, you should just stop and don't do it. So. I still finished the course because it gave me, I don't know how to say it in English, but um, in Portuguese it's the basically last school year, the one school year that uh, most of the jobs nowadays require as a minimum, because the course also gave uh, the equivalent of it, so I still finished the course for it, but it was hard. Top of all I had to work in a, an hotel, that uh, well, not easy. It, it, like the shuttle, for real, it wasn't that bad for a kitchen. You get up early and finish at midday, or you start up in the end of the after uh, in the afternoon to finish at midnight, one maybe even sometimes two a.m. But it's fine for for, for a kitchen for real. And um, yeah, now changing area, it's fucking tough. The feeling of being lost was never as high as a weight for me as it is right now. It's tough. And the moments that I am waiting for something but I don't know if I should be waiting or doing something else, it's not good. But well. It was all for this episode, it was maybe a little too chill, I know, I apologize for it. I wasn't expecting at all the shovel not being able to dig an X mark. But well. You'll have an episode for today. I'll upload it right now. In about one hour it should come out. 
and I'll record the other two as soon as this one is uploaded so the PC won't lag. So guys, thank you so much for being there one more time with me, with yourselves, all together, wherever you want. And next episode we'll go further, we'll just start moving things around. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Consider leaving a comment to talk about some work experience that you had, good or bad, if you changed the area, what did you do? And, um, well, I, I hope you're not too mad at me for this, by the way. Anyway, consider leaving a comment like this, subscribing, and leave a like if you liked the video, or a dislike if you didn't, and guys, see you for the next video. Stay where you are, you're amazing, see you.